first doctor who saw me just told me to rest for the rest of the night. And the second doctor, 20 minutes later, put me to the ICU in a four weeks coma. It started with a bad stomach ache. A few hours later, I went into cardiac arrest. I was only 22 years old, and at first the doctors didn't believe me. My mom had to insist on more tests being done. The doctors did not know what was happening until they cut my body open in half. It was sepsis. It was only after an respiratory arrest that the doctors questioned, could this be sepsis? The immediate reaction of the doctor saved my life. Every second counts. Sepsis is the way the body responds to an infection. But in sepsis, the body's immune system goes into overdrive. And it's that immune system overreacting that if we don't stop it, will start to damage our organs. We need to empower health professionals, both in the community and in hospital, to think sepsis earlier and to be able to undertake simple bedside tests that can help them to identify whether that patient has a significant risk of having sepsis. Early diagnosis of sepsis is critical. To fight sepsis, it needs to be recognised immediately. Despite sepsis, everyone needs to know about it. The abionic PSP test can potentially save thousands of lives. Stop sepsis. Stop sepsis. Stop sepsis. Stop sepsis.